And today, the sixth city council meeting is happening at the Laredo City Hall. They are discussing the opposition to the proposals made by the group of citizens moving Laredo forward. Jasmina Trevino has the latest. At today's city council meeting, there were several topics open for discussion, and one of them was the city council members opposing to the all-large district members and also to the expansion in power and duties for the city mayor. These ideas uh, that they're bringing forward are one is to have a 75% veto power so that the mayor can basically win every, every vote and, and wipe out the city council. And this is just a, uh, an idea to give the mayor absolute power and, and power corrupts but absolute power corrupts absolutely. It's create these at-large districts where uh, council members would have to run in the entire city, they would have to collect large sums of money and they would have to go to these power brokers, these wealthy individuals who want to control the city and, and who are behind moving Laredo forward and then they could control who's on city council and basically control the city's budget and control all the city's contracts. That's what's going on here. On the other hand, a possible action requested by Councilman Esteban Rangel on increasing the salary for the mayor and the city council members, saying he's not doing this for his own benefit since today is his last meeting as council member of District 2. Only time that a uh, that this could happen is whenever you're going up for re-election for that same seat, or whenever you're leaving the seat. Uh, so uh, since I'm leaving the seat, I'm I'm, I'm willing to do this. Um, I get no benefit out of it. You know, for the type of work that we do, uh, it should be important to to be able to get some type of of compensation back. The city council meeting still continues, but we will bring you the latest tomorrow. From Fox 39, I'm Jasmina Treviño. Thank you, Jasmina, for this information.